It's time to kick back, reload and reminisce as we cover the best weapons in PC gaming history. You can chart the history of PC gaming through some of its most inventive and iconic weapons. Weapons define games because they're the main way we interact with the world. But it's not just about getting rid of enemies with brutal efficiency, though they are pretty good at that. The most memorable weapons can also be tools to help us solve puzzles, explore environments and even defy gravity. So relax, stick your best Logitech G headphones on and get ready for a journey through time and space, covering blunt objects, alien weaponry and everything in between. Before we let you go though, do be sure to like, subscribe and headshot that notification bell so we can celebrate our favourite hobby with even more great videos on games. You know I don't find that amusing. Rise and shine, Mr Freeman, it's time to wake up and smell the head crabs because our first weapon is the gravity gun from Half-Life 2. Formerly introduced in the Ravenholm level, we don't go there. The zero-point energy field manipulator was a paradigm shift for the first-person shooter, removing the need for ammo and introducing the ultimate tool for demonstrating the powerful physics of Valve's source engine. Boxes, barrels, saw blades and even enemies themselves became tools of destruction overnight. And this played a huge part in making Half-Life 2 so dynamic and replayable. I got one. This is why it was no surprise to see Valve implement gravity gun technology as one of the main mechanics in its virtual reality prequel Half-Life Alex, which shows just how important it is to the spirit of the series and PC gaming at large. If this list makes anything clear, it's that Valve knows how to make a weapon. The portal device came after the studio's experiment with gravity guns and immediately captured the imagination of those of us who were trapped in the labyrinth of Aperture. Hello, and again, welcome to the Aperture Science Computer Aided Enrichment Center. What if you could just bend space and time for the sake of puzzles and a promised cake? Chaos, hilarity and, of course, important science lessons ensued. Regardless of whether you're completing a tricky test or just trying to mess with your robot co-op partner, there's still a sense of magic to the portal gun that's endured even a decade after the original game's release. Excellent. With a timeless mechanic powering it and satisfying sound effects to boot, it's often replicated but never beaten. This puzzle-focused gun redefined what a PC gaming weapon could be. You remain resolute and resourceful in an atmosphere of extreme pessimism. Over time, Assassin's Creed games have given us new characters to play as and several historic periods to explore, but one thing always remains the same. Even if Ubisoft warps the formula dramatically, as they have with the most recent entries, we can always expect the hidden blade to appear in some shape or form. Whether you started playing the game in 2007 or 2020, we're sure you'll remember the first time you painstakingly set up a stealth kill with the hidden blade and managed to walk away without a trace. This man is dead. There's nothing quite as gratifying as stealth, but the hidden blade's versatility is its greatest strength. It doesn't matter if you're leaping from rooftops or hiding in hay bales, it's always going to get the job done. The weapon is inseparable from this series and video game history as a result. Sounds like fun. Mind if I join you? The next gun has the same initials as the Roald Dahl character, but while it is giant, you couldn't call it friendly, especially if you're a space alien. Doom Guy's big f gun is id Software's ultimate ripping and tearing device, fine-tuned to turn Mars monsters into paste. A special treat for Doom fans, this gun deals absurd amounts of damage for those brave enough to wield it, and is symbolic of the series' unwavering love for ultraviolence. PC gaming owes a lot to the influence of Doom, and this memorable weapon has been an important staple of the series since 1993, an eclectic example of the mayhem video game weapons are capable of. Its latest appearance was in the 2020's current-gen smash Doom Eternal, but its giant green energy balls are platform agnostic, eviscerating enemies on everything from MS-DOS to the Nintendo Switch. Calculating optimal firing path. When you hear this noise, you roadie run for your life. 
More than just a simple assault rifle, the Lancer from Gears of War reinvented the ye old bayonet system, swapping out the spike for a vicious chainsaw that separates locusts and other players into meaty chunks. As indulgent as it is to down a player and rip them in half, the Lancer is just as exciting to use as a regular weapon, especially when you land an active reload and start popping headshots with precious bullets. Another versatile weapon that the Gears of War series couldn't live without. The smart, engaging design of the Lancer has made it one of the most iconic weapons in all of gaming. Easily the most infamous weapon in eSports, Counter-Strike's AWP, or AWP as it's more often known, makes a sinister noise that strikes fear into each of our hearts, regardless of our skill level. With its excessive damage output and easy-to-use, hard-to-master difficulty curve, it's one of the most game-changing weapons ever designed. Capable of doling out disgusting wall bangs and collaterals in casual and championship games. Barks and trembling callouts like AWP in Heaven or AWPA can signal the end of any tense round, as this expensive but risky weapon proves its value in the right hands. It speaks to the historic influence of the AWP that a high-powered sniper rifle modelled after it is simply expected in any modern shooter with competitive ambitions nowadays. Nice shot. One of the most evocative pop culture weapons also doubles as a gaming staple. Across PC gaming history, several studios have been tasked with replicating the unique feeling of wielding a lightsaber and putting that power into our hands. It's a cornerstone of the virtual Star Wars experience, from the superb sound design of the flickering blade to the way Jedis use it to dance and outwit their lumbering enemies. It all has to be fine-tuned so you feel just like a Jedi in combat. That's not an easy maneuver. From death-defying acrobatic duels to more one-sided attacks on stormtroopers, the lightsaber is a deceptively simple weapon whose potential has been expanded upon thanks to video games. The prospect of brandishing a lightsaber and recreating your childhood daydreams is just too exciting to pass up. Oh, this is it. In such a fragile environment as Bioshock's Rapture, your weaponry is of much importance. Now, would you kindly find a crowbar or something? Which is why the game's wrench and trusty plasmids remain so memorable. While it's not exactly the preferred tool for taking down a big daddy, feel free to have a go if you think you're hard enough, the Humble Wrench is formative in how it helps you navigate the vulnerable, atmospheric early game and its close quarters combat arenas full of spooky splicers. Plasmids, on the other hand, introduce unmatched gameplay variety, allowing you to tinker with Bioshock's immersive simulator foundations, using the environment to concoct traps and trick your enemies with as many powers as your Eve addled arms will allow. The beauty of Bioshock's RPG design is that you could easily focus on plasmids or melee with specific tonics and upgrades too. Wrench only run, anyone? Hold on and everything will be fine. Excuse the pun, but Halo's entire arsenal is legendary. Bungie's weapon design skills are undeniable, from the assault rifle to the classic Magnum, but there's something particularly groundbreaking about the Needler. This piece of Covenant technology, usually wielded by gibbering grunts, stacks devastating shards of pink pain on targets before they explode, blasting off like Team Rocket. The faster you can kill those brutes, the better. It might not be the most skill-based weapon in the game, but it's ridiculously fun to use in battle and one of the most unique shooter weapons the medium has ever seen. The pure, childish joy of making your enemies pop is fundamental to the DNA of Halo at this point, no matter how many times you've been on the wrong end of it. Fear the pink mist. Kill me or release me, parasite. But do not waste my time with talk. Geralt of Rivia is a legendary monster slayer, but he'd be nothing without his swords. Silver for monsters and steel for humans is the hard and fast rule, which leads to interesting combat situations where the Witcher must switch, try saying that one ten times, in between battles to make sure they're using the right tools for the job. Coated in oil and tempered to perfection, Geralt's swords have followed us all throughout the epic narrative of the beloved CD Projekt Red trilogy on PC. They've kept us safe from dreaded drowners, drunken townsfolk and the wild hunt, 
augmenting the flourish-filled dance-like combat. Geralt's weapons factor in as an important part of our journey and, as a result, have secured themselves a spot in the PC Gaming Weapon Hall of Fame. Happy for you, but I'm kinda in a hurry. So those were just some of the best weapons in PC gaming, but please let us know in the comments what would make the cut if you were calling the shots. And if you enjoyed it, then please do feel free to leave us a like, slap that subscribe button and trickshot the notification bell to be kept up to date with all things Logitech G. After that shotgun blast of nostalgia, we're off to jump into some old games for however long that lasts. So see you next time. Okay, let's try this again.